I'm in the kitchen today and I'm whipping up a little recipe that is literally for the birds. I love to watch hummingbirds and I have two hummingbird feeders. Uh, we know that buying hummingbird feed from the store can be kind of expensive. So I have a homemade recipe that I'm gonna show you how to make. So we're going to start out. We've got a two quart boiler and I'm going to measure one cup of sugar over into this boiler. Okay, there we go. Now the next thing we wanna do, let's go to the sink. And we need to add four cups of water. Okay, we want to take this back to the stove, put it on the burner, we're going to turn our heat up about medium high, stir this a little bit. And we want this water and sugar to heat up and we need the sugar to dissolve into the water. So that's what we're doing now. And it will take a minute or two to get this sugar to dissolve. So we'll just let this heat right now and I'll come back and check it in a minute. Okay, so our um, hummingbird feed has been cooling for a little while. It's cooled down. And uh, you can see how that the, the mixture is clear. The sugar has dissolved into the water, so that leaves that clear. Now, we know that hummingbirds are attracted to red. And usually when you buy hummingbird feeder, uh, hummingbird feed in the store, it's gonna be red. So we want to make this red. So I have some food coloring, red food coloring. Pour a little bit of this in here so that it will turn it red. The hummingbirds will be attracted to this. Okay, got it a pretty red color there. Now we want to pour this into the feeder Let's go over to the sink. Got my hummingbird feeder right here. I funnel on top of it. We're gonna fill this feeder up. Okay, there we go, that's got it full. Okay, let's put the bottom on it. All right, and we're ready to take this outside and hang it up. I'm gonna flip it right side up once I get outside because sometimes a little bit of the liquid can spill out, and so we don't want that to spill in the house. I've got a little hanger right up under my carport here, and that's where I'm going to hang the feeder. Okay, before I step up, let's flip this upside, uh, right side up. Okay. There we go. I'm going to hang it up. All right, we've got our food ready for our hummingbirds to come visit. 